Hello, cats and kittens. It's a good day here today. It's not Sprinkle. She's gone. At least not here. Not for yoga. It's April Fools, and uh, the joke's on you guys. The uh, I'll be leaving you in your morning stretch routine. So while we wait for everybody to come, I'll uh, let you guys get your uh, your spot uh, organized. You're not in the wrong place. This is uh, Coach Sprinkles' early morning stretching. Your friendly lion will be doing the, leading you in your stretches today. Now you might think, why is a lion leading your stretches? Well, is he, it was either me or the Tin Man. And let's face it, can you imagine the Tin Man trying to lead you in a forward fold? That would be ridiculous. Just ridiculous. Okay, so while we're here, we'll start with some, uh, just some easy breaths in and out. And, uh, and while I do that, let your, uh, We'll do some neck rolls while we'll do that. So start with your right ear to your right shoulder. Breathe in and then breathe out and let your uh, neck fall. Then go to your left as you inhale and then back down. A few of those follow, follow along with your breath. All right, let's do uh, three more. Do uh, neck rolls to your right, and then back down, exhaling, letting your head fall. Then up to your left with an inhale, and then back down. One more on each side. Okay, let's do a, an arm stretch with a big inhale, exhale, drop your arms. Another inhale. And drop your arms. Now, if you're just joining, you might be wondering why is there a man in a lion suit leading stretches? That's a good question. I don't have an answer for that other than it's April Fool's Day. And I guess the joke is on you. But let's continue. Deep breath in. And exhale. Deep breath in. And exhale. You might be asking yourself, again, I'm looking at a lion. 
what's so special about a lion? Well, the best thing about lions is lions are wonderful things. So one more time, we'll inhale and reach up, and then we'll exhale. All right, now we're gonna go to uh, cat cow. Okay, spread your, uh, oh. move the blanket if you don't want it. So breathe in and stretch your, uh, your neck forward to your best cow pose. And exhale to your best lion or cat pose and stretch your back. When you in inhale and you think about the cow, I like to tell my pups to uh, imagine playing with your food and how fun it would be. A good, good visual for uh, the lion cubs. Breathe in. Exhale. All right, two more. Follow along at your own uh, breathing pace. All right, very good. Now we're going to do some standing stretches. I love standing stretches. They're great! So uh, let's start with some more just inhales, breathing all the way in, stretching up, then exhaling down. <clears throat> now if you want to switch it up instead of just your normal Breathing up uh, and swinging your arms out. You can do what I call the Rafiki. And back down. I like to alternate. Regular stretch up. The Rafiki. Very good. Now on this next one, I want you to think about your favorite self-indulgent musical song. And I want you to sing that at the top of your lungs after you take a nice, big, big inhale breath. Like this. If I were the king of the forest, I rough and I rough and I rough. Exhale that song all the way out, and we'll finish it up with one big cleansing breath. And an exhale. All right. Now we're going to go with uh, an inhale and a forward fold. Let it all the way out. Pretend you're the scarecrow as you go to the bottom. Just let your hands and your arms dangle. Uh, don't scarecrow, scarecrow from the legs down. Just scarecrow from the waist up. Hold here for a few seconds. And then back up. All right, let's go again. Exhale to the scarecrow.
Inhale. Exhale back down. Let's do two more. Last one. Okay, <clears throat> last thing for today. This will be cut short. We're gonna do some uh, uh, some sun salutations with some uh, up dogs and down dogs. I like to call them up lines and down lines, but you know. Let's go ahead and get a step to the front of your mat. <clears throat> Inhale. Forward fold. <clears throat> go pro. Upward dog. Down dog. Now, if you want to, you can uh, stretch your calves really well, like you're about to pounce on, on someone. Kind of like a, a tigger, tigger pouncing. That's the kind of pouncing we do, friendly lines. Alternate uh, putting pressure on each calf, get a good calf stretch. All right, back to uh, walk your legs forward. And now back up. This isn't exactly your typical yoga. You might uh, be already aware of that, but we're gonna go through it anyway. Inhale up, change to Rafiki. Yes, okay. And let's exhale down. Forward fold, go prone, hide in the bushes like an unfriendly lion, upward cat, downward cat. Mm, alternate if you need to, pressure on each calf really helps with your pouncing if you can stretch those calves back and forth all right walk forward back up all right we'll do two more of these uh, Inhale, forward fold, scarecrow. Hide in the bushes. Look for uh, look for food to play with, and then stretch your calves. Walker, step forward. Ooh, raise up. Throw your mane back. Oh, exhale. All right, last one. Inhale. Reach for the sky. Maybe there's a small animal in a tree you want to play with. Exhale. Scarecrow down. 
hide in the tall grass, look for food, and get ready to pounce. Step forward. One last inhale and a cleansing breath. Okay. Get your blanket if you have one. Leave you with uh, one minute of, of closing thoughts as we relax. As the most famous of all lines once said, don't run from who you are. I'd like you to go, like uh, those words to go with you today, don't run from who you are and enjoy the rest of your April Fool's Day. Oh, one more thing. I'm very scared of online comments, so be nice. And I don't even know how to end this. So it's another thing I need to work on. <laughs>